everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. It's season 42, and this is war number six. And we're going up against an alliance called Hellcat. Oh boy, this should be interesting. All right, who have they banned? All right, Galen is not banned. Uh, Ghost, Nimrod, and uh, Magneto. Okay. All right, let's uh, take a look at their lineup here. See what we got going on. Oh, my. Okay. Doom. Interesting. All right. Well, and we've got <laughs> we've got uh, Immortal Hulk here. So there's no need for Gallon on, on this path here. So let's see. Ew, I hate fighting uh, Jabari Panther, though. Um, but I don't think that that's a big deal. Ooh, her. I'm not so sure, and I remember him. Falcon, ugh. And uh, future Ant-Man. All right, um, let me think. Because I remember this guy, and I definitely, yeah. We need a shock immune for him. Definitely, definitely. Um, Shock immune. Yeah, and he's going to glance. Ugh. Yeah. So, probably Hulkling or Nebula. And if I bring Nebula, she can also take this node here and take her. So Nebula might be the play, but also Warlock. Let's see what we got going on over here. Yeah, if I brought Warlock, I could probably take mm, too much to think about. Let me make sure I have my path uh, secured. So every time I see Immortal Hulk, I think Nick Fury. I love using Nick Fury um, against Immortal Hulk, and he would also do well here against this uh, Doom. An effect they're immune to, okay. Yeah, so Nick Fury would handle Doom and Immortal Hulk. Then I can take Hulkling or Nebula. And if I bring Nebula, she should be able to handle... Um, yeah, she should be able to handle both of these. So that would be Nebula... Um, Nick Fury, and then if, yeah, I wonder, anybody want to take this future Ant-Man? Yeah, that was, that was a rough one. That high energy diet, man. Ugh. Um, but yeah, so if I do that, I can probably bring one person for somebody here or for this node here that we always have problems with. Incinerate shock. Hmm. Yeah, I'll talk it over, but it looks like I can do Nick Fury and Nebula and bring someone else maybe to help clear that node of that um that uh, uh Nemo here. All right, let me talk it over and we will be right back. And we're back. And this is the team that I'm going in with. Hulkling, Nebula, and Odin. Now, the reason I'm bringing in Odin is he's needed for one of the shared fights. 
which means I had an extra space. Hulkling and Nebula should be able to handle my entire path, including the mini. Now, you remember what happened to me on that node last war. Yeah, we're not going there again. All right, so I'm going to boost up a little bit here, and we're going to fight this Hulk. So on this particular path, if there's anybody that does not gain armor ups, you can basically bring a good counter to them. They don't benefit from the node at all. Okay, so you don't have to worry about any of the extra challenges that you would face with somebody with uh, armor up. Okay, so we're fighting Hulk here, Immortal. And I love Hulkling. All right, Hulkling is a beast. All right, I want you to see this guy. All right, so first of all, one of the things that I like is that hitting into their block, it avoids a lot of things. Notice he's not getting any of his gamma charges. All right, now here we go. Look at this. Mm, mm, ooh, ow, oh, and it's done. What happened to his immortality? He couldn't get enough gamma charges. That's what happened to it. Same thing happens usually when I use uh, Nick Fury. Um, but Hulkling is a beast. Even though I recently ranked up a different Cosmic, he was the one I was going to take up to rank five, and you can see why. All right, so Baron Zemo, uh, they needed the uh, Odin pre-fights on him. I was not going to be taking him, um, but I just put all the, the uh, Odin pre-fights on and then waited uh, for the middle to be cleared. And um, let's see, I probably went to sleep. See, we got 20 hours. Yeah, look at this. Four hours left from 20 to four hours left. Okay. So um, I did move up, as you saw, uh, to use up energy before I went to bed. So now we've got Viv Vision, who I was not that familiar fighting, but I have fought her and I didn't remember anything special. And with Nebula, I figured she's going to shut her down anyway. So a basic Nebula fight, you know, build up. Nebula is um, bleed immune, so I don't have to worry about it. Um, I couldn't remember if she got armor ups, but it wouldn't matter. Um, yep, look at that. 16 she started with. And if you don't have a look at that that happened because i was not used to her heavy attack okay no input issue there just i got to get used to her heavy all right but now i've got the charges so she um is shut down so i can just go ahead and fight and then here i decided to build up more charges while she did that awesome looking special and my goal, of course, is to build all the way up. Going all the way up. And then here, I'm like, okay, I got 20. And she pushed me to a special three. I'm like, come on, that is not what I wanted. And I know the AI does that on purpose. But I'm like, okay, fine. Still got my 20, okay. Still giving the shocks because of uh, my special three. But she is eating away at my health. Look at that damage through my block. So I went ahead and hit her with that shock and was like, come on, come on. But it didn't quite finish her. Now, if I had had my special two, this fight would have been over earlier. But we got her down. We'll, we'll learn for next time. Just got to um, get the right combo, build up to that you know, 20, parry, hit her with a special two, and the fight is going to be over. All right. But I will say this. The AI did do what it needed to do to preserve its life. Now, this one here, Captain America, Sam Wilson. And I remember fighting this guy and losing 
on this particular node. Okay, do you see that static defense? Yeah, that can be a problem, but that's fine because Hulkling is shock immune. So don't really care. Now, I don't know how to evade his special two. Um, I usually block it, but it does a lot of damage. Um, did I go in with... Yeah, I think I did go in with uh, Nebula. I know I was planning to go in with... Um... Oh, I remember now. I was going to be using... Do you see the green around him? I took his SIG up to uh, 180 out after I had already joined uh, the war. I don't think it counts which is why you get the green one. I I'm not sure. Um, I never really fully understood that. It might count. It might not. Don't remember. Um, but the reason that I decided not to go in with Hulkling is because I'm going to be using Hulkling for future Ant-Man in the next fight. So although Hulkling could have done this fight, definitely, um, I decided to heal up Nebula. And Nebula wasn't going to do the next fight but hulkling for that future ant-man and that was a fight that i've never done before okay so you can see here i'm baiting out his special ones because i don't want to deal with that special two okay you see i i hit with a special uh with a parry and got the shocks and i couldn't fire the special two because he likes to auto block so i could only just parry Okay, so here we go. Give, get myself a little room because he's got me in the corner now. Um, but I want to get a parry off. You know? Bait that out. Okay, now we need that little parry. There we go. And he's going to be hurting. Don't worry about the glancing. And done. So two ramp ups, two parries, done. And because she's shock immune, in fact, she's she's not only shock immune, she gets benefit from being shocked. So a perfect counter there. All right, so this one here, first time I'm going in, this was recommended. And I'm like, okay, um, I didn't see any videos, but I was like, I have an idea of how I need to fight this fight. As long as his attacks are not energy, and you can see that high energy diet, that's the thing I'm worried about. If you didn't see my last war, go look, and you'll see why I'm worried about it. All right? So basically, I'm going to hit into his block, build up those pierce, okay? And we're doing damage. We got the uh, unblockable, and we're just hurting him. We are just hurting him. Look at this. Look at this. We just block that. Don't worry about it. Doesn't hurt. Okay. Keep on going. Pretty straightforward, right? Look at this. Look at this. So I'm setting things up because I want a big special too if I can help, uh, can get it. And because he's immune to, I believe, um, steel. He's not immune to the burn. Okay. So you see here? There we go. Bam. Bam. Bam, that's what I was setting up. You know, get the pierce, get the unblockable, then fire the special two, and you do a buttload of damage. Very easy fight, very quick fight, all right? So that is what we'll do every single time we see future Ant-Man um, and Hulkling is not banned. All right, that's it for my participation in the war. We'll be back in a minute, and you'll find out how this war ended. And we're back. And unfortunately, we lost this war. This was a very close war. Okay, take a look. Very close war. Now, we didn't have full diversity because of a um, mistake that one of us made. But even if we had had full diversity, we would have still lost, um, as far as I can see. Uh, you guys can correct me on that. but. Um, it looks like 60 points, 
but we lost by more than that, right? Uh, 300. So we would have still lost. Uh, but anyway, that is going to do it. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day. Thank you.